Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm super excited today. I know I'm so late and still I'm going to do my October favorites. I have loads of things to show you guys, mostly makeup. So without any further ado, let's go into the video. And please don't forget to like this video and do subscribe guys. I'll be going in order like foundation, blush, highlighter and etc and etc. So the first thing is I I am in love with this Nykaa stick foundation in the shade 02. I I have been using this daily. I don't like the liquid foundation in Nykaa. I prefer the stick foundation. I'm literally I, I use it as my day-to-day -day wear for uh, either uh, for office or hospital or even while even you guys can use it while going to college it gives you a very sheer finish no it doesn't give you a full coverage so that's why I like this product it's really good guys for contour whenever I go out I like to do a cream contour so I just love this NYX wonder stick in the shade medium um, I'm in love one side it's the this side is the contour stick as you guys can see I have completed most of the product and the other side is like a highlighter bar concealer and I'm not a fan of this side that is why it is untouched <laughs> it is not my shade of color it is like white not my shade and this side it is like a brown a bit darker shade I either try to go in for a darker shade guys like a deep dark or dark instead of going for medium like me next is my uh, blush and highlighter as a drugstore product i just wanted to try out this nyx professional blush, blush palette and i'm in love it is very powdery but otherwise it is super pigmented guys it's really very pigmented and i like the highlighter shade also i didn't expect i didn't expect this from maybelline at all did it take Maybelline or Max? So one of my favorite uh, product and it uh, it retails for uh, thousand bucks and it, I feel it's worth worth the price. If you guys are interested, I will link it down below. And next, let's go in for eyes. For eyes, I have few products. Uh, one is the Kajal. It is the iconic from Lakme. One of my favorite. It is so black, guys. It's really black. It is super black and it is my favorite. I have used this in my under eyes today. And next is this Nykaa Get Inked uh, which is which has this tip instead of the winged tip. I just like this a lot. I have been using I, I just give it a very thin line as I go for college and I just apply mascara and leave. If you guys are interested in my day to day makeup tutorial, a very simple makeup tutorial, please do like this video and do comment. I have this Christina hashtag 605 eyelashes which I have applied today. It is one of the best eyelashes for the price. It just, as you guys can see, it makes a difference, a huge difference. Uh, it, it looks a bit natural and not too dramatic. That's why I like about this lashes. And uh, if you guys, I got this from Amazon as a bulk. Like if you get six, you get it for thousand bucks. Normally, when you get a Huda Beauty lashes and all, it is around two thousand. 500 to 3000 per lash set that is super costly guys so if you guys are planning to do eyelashes and if you wanted to explore and wanted to learn how to apply lashes i think you can go in for this option if you want i will link this link uh, i got it from amazon so i can link uh, this below in the description box you can check it out guys let's go into lips for lips i have few products the first one is this uh, mac lip liner hover it has a very brown tinge. It has a very brown tinge, so I just apply it all around my lips. And sometimes I have to just wear a lip gloss and walk off. I wear a very tinge of lipstick, and that will be fine. And I have two lipsticks today to show you guys. One is this Nykaa lip paint, the shade 04, and it is it has a peachy undertone, and that is what I have uh, applied today on my lips. And if you guys do want a tutorial on this look, please do like this video and please comment saying that you guys are interested in this look. Oh, and next one is my NYX Soft Matte Lip Cream in the shade Prague. And it's a wonderful pink and I'm in love. 
It's a beautiful pink on our skin tone, guys. Seriously, you guys will love this. Please do get this, guys. And I have two more products <laughs> in lips also. And these two are my ultimate favorite. Both are lip balms. And I use this Dior Lip Glow. Uh, mainly before uh, applying my makeup, like moisturize and just uh, apply a lip balm and then I'll start with my makeup so that it gives a moisturizing lips and it has a pinch of pink in it. There are a few shades also. One, uh, this is the pinkish one, the others are a bit berry shade and etc. I think this is Dior Adit Lip Glow in the shade 001 Pink. So, this is my favorite, guys. It, it doesn't show any tinge at all. As you guys can see, no tinge, it's just transparent. It has a very mild tinge. One of my favorite to apply it before my makeup. <laughs> and this Clarins Instant uh, Light Lip Comforting Oil has, uh, it is a very good oil. It has more of products like different types of oil in it and it enriches and boosts our lips without drying, cracking and etc. And mainly in this winter time, even in Chennai, it's raining and it's really cold guys. And mainly at this time, we need uh, to moisturize our lips. This is very thick and I love the applicator guys. Seriously. I just love this applicator. It is perfect when you apply over your lips. It is really thick but it's not chappy. Like once you apply oil, it is not chappy. It is really smooth and really nice guys. Even this has no tinge at it. It's just plain. And, I love, and there are different uh, uh, smell and taste in it. And this is the raspberry one. And there is one honey one and few other shades guys and this I think I got it from Sephora in Express Avenue and it retails for 2100 I think but it's worth it comes for a very long time guys and I have been using few I have been exploring on beauty blenders a lot I tried getting my hands on this Nykaa beauty blender which I hate I don't know for what reason I hate those beauty blenders uh, instead of that I'm I prefer this Forever 21 Beauty Blender. I seriously did not think I will love this Forever 20 Beauty Blender. But once I have used everything, I feel this is the best. As you guys can see, this is super dirty. I have been using this constantly, guys. It's really very dirty. Last but not the least, my favorite perfume of the day. Ta-da! This is my go-to perfume. It's like my scent. Once I have added, it's like my signature scent. I just love this. It is a Chanel Chance perfume. It smells really good guys. It's really... It smells so fresh florally and it's beautiful guys. And mine is... And I, it has come to an end and, and I'm, I cannot wait to get a new bottle. Seriously, I have been using this for past one month. And I'm in love. As you guys can see, it has come to an end. So next is hair. I know this was a big issue when I did my uh, uh, whether I will use the product or not, like empty products and etc. And I have re and I cursed my head and shoulders product a lot, the shampoo. And so I tried my Vichy Darkos shampoo. Previously, I was using this red one and the green one, and in between they have they had stopped it. So once it came back, I started I tr I wanted to try this Vichy Darkos. And it works. I don't have much of hair fall. I still have hair fall. It's not like completely stopped. But still it works. Compared to my previous thing. This really works guys. And. And the same thing. I got a new bottle of my conditioner. This is my go to Moroccan oil. Smoothening conditioner this is. It just smoothens and it gives me a spa effect guys. I love this. Seriously it's a beautiful product. Please do get it and try it and let me know whether it worked on you guys and please do try to use it from here and below not over it because once it touches your scalp i feel i seriously feel that i have hair fall so it might be the same for you guys so try to use it below your ears and after washing my hair i mostly use live on to just smoothen my hair and remove all the knots and etc and recently i found a new product that is this lux oil from Vela. Uh, it is a bit pricey around 2300 or so but you get it you get around you get 100 ml which is a huge amount of product and it works amazing guys it is so smooth like when it's wet i just pump two two pumps and just 
rub my fingers and just try to apply it all over and mainly to the ends my ends have become so smooth it is not rough and i feel my split ends are also subsided because of this i'm not sure whether this this is because of that or not so here it has told us apply one to two pumps distribute throughout the hair for instant and lasting smoothness and it works also oh, this this retails for 2500 guys and i feel it's worth please do try and let me know guys so i normally tend to shave my underarms and the best so recently i have come to this satin cast sensitive skin shaving gel so what i do i just pump i rub it and apply and just shave it upon it so it gives me a smoother finish no bumps no cuts or anything so guys i have been binge watching this tv episode a big little lies oh my god i didn't expect it was so beautifully taken it is so perfect i hope everyone watches this serial i just binged what i think it has around 10 to 12 episodes i watched it in hot star a feature about girls point of view how they deal with things how they deal and how they become friends because of one situation it's like super in interesting guys you just cannot stop it in one episode or so you will really binge watch it guys please do watch it and let me know which is your favorite character and after you guys comment on it i will let you know on my snapchat or in my instagram stories saying who's my favorite character <laughs> So guys this is the end of this video I hope you guys love this video all of my favorite things of October I know it's I'm a bit late but still I hope you guys really liked it so please don't forget to subscribe and like this video guys until next time I will see you soon guys bye from Rishi